All right, here we go. What the fuck is up? Higher point of view gaming here. I'm gonna show you what we got. Madden 23, already known. How to help Madden to come through. There's one more final thing. Game I'm about to show you guys, okay? So this is a series that's coming out next year, man. Y'all gonna follow me through my journey next year. It's called Mutt. Okay. Remember that. Mutt Nathan. Man and Ultimate Nathan. Now, you play this game so much, the old lady, the, the other five, whatever you want to call them for her, you know. You're on this game a lot, so sometimes when y'all got shit to do or when it's time for date night or whatever, you know, they start tracking games. They're like, well, it's the second quarter, so you got two more quarters, right? Be like, yeah, but with this game, like, I ain't even got to play a game. Like, be stuck on this motherfucker for hours without even in an actual live game. You'll just be maintaining it, making your team better team, best team too. So to make my team better here, got this Eric Stokes card already. Don't know how he's going to play. He's a go 99, but again, never know how these cards are going to work out. Some of them have glitches, some of them work out. Some players play better than their rating, some players play worse than their rating. I haven't figured it out with him yet. But, one more last thing I need to do in this game. Obviously, the new man is coming out next year, so I'm not spending really any time in this game. But, y'all wait on the next one. One thing I have to do here, I see this card Lucas Van Ness Gold 99, okay? Uh, be limited on time with it. Let's see what they say. In order to get this card, I already got one guy. I have to get a, a 98 rating quarterback. I mean, not cornerback, but really anything. Any 98 overall red zone royale player. So what it says is, change to 98 red zone royale players to receive 99 is Van Ness and ultimate rookie token. Ultimate rookie token is just a token to give you Add it to a set and gain better players. Okay. So uh it says you will also get a version of the player in Madden 4. He and they put a time limit on August 10th, 2015. Last day that we could do this. Alright, so be on the time limit. This is probably the last thing that I care about doing this game. Why? Because it's gonna transfer over to the new game. Well, well my Lucas been as the new Madden. So, uh, we're gonna do what we gotta do to get it. Already got this guy, baby in the crowd. We already got this motherfucker. So, now we're gonna see how much it costs. This is about making it, y'all. This is how we grind and do what we need to do to get better players. I'm about to feel how I get in. So, look. In order to get the Lucas Van S for player. And the cheapest one is for $274,000. Now, do we got $274,000? Hell no. We got one time. We pretty much a hundred K away from gaining Lucas Van Ness. We gotta do it before the tenth. So oh, I don't know what the day is to see seventh, but we got a couple days, but we're gonna try to get him like tonight. Not only tonight, but right now. So I'm gonna show y'all how we can grind and do different things. Get players. Right now we got 169 up coins, Madden coins, obviously 274. I don't have enough. What are we gonna do? We got eight thousand. 8,500 training. So this is what we're going to do, y'all. This is how you play the game, man. This is the game before the game. We ain't even playing games. We're getting better teams. We're making our team better, all right? So in order to get that Van Ness, we need another $100,000. How are we going to get $100,000? Our, our, our notebook, all these players in there. So I got these two players, right? So... Again, y'all gonna go through the whole journey with me. Y'all gonna understand the terminology. I'm gonna talk like y'all already know what I'm talking about. Tune in next year so I can break it down. It's gonna be like Madden for dummies, like Mutt for dummies, Madden Ultimate Team. Now, motherfuckers that don't play this, you get a real good understanding of how this shit goes. So, basically, these two players here, I got them in a set, right? I got them by, I had to buy these two players. Add them in the set to get this Eric Stokes right here. Okay, that's that. The re I added them to a set, so now I can't use them for another set. But what I can do, I'm not gonna use 
in black men at free safety. I have a better free safety. Just holding it down right now. I don't need a center right now. What I'm going to do is pick on these cards. Now, oh, cards do different things. Some cards you can sell. Some cards you can just quick sell for trading. Training. Training helps you get better players. Training helps you upgrade your players. Training is very important in the game. So, I can't do anything with them. All I can do is come on them to a starter, quick sell them. Already have pre safety that's better than him. I don't need them on my team, so I'm gonna quick sell them for this 57,000 training. I now you see my training went up. I got 66,000 training. So now what I'm gonna do is turn this training into hopefully a good player. How are we gonna do that? Go to the marketplace. The marketplace is where all you know you can get certain kind of players and certain kind of deals. Y'all see the kind of money taxes. So we can pay out of our pocket. That's the green 800 right there. Or we can pay with fake mad money. Ultimate team, 7,000. I didn't add a 47,000. What y'all do? I could just swipe my credit card. Or I already got my shit stored in. I could buy me back with real money. Some people use real money in this shit. People go away with just grinding, making their fake mad money to buy shit. You can do it either way. I used to not buy anything, but goddamn it, sometimes you just drop a dub. You drop 50 for real, for real, and just get these players more easy, you know, more easily. But uh, yeah, so we got 66,000 training. What we gonna do is buy a training variety pack. Now this is a crapshoot, but what you can do, we got 66, we got enough for this 55. Look at all the possibilities we can get. Hey, I'm down a hundred thousand dollars. I could buy this. We either get a gold ticket player, platinum players, strategy items, uniforms, limited players. Like it's just a crapshoot. I might roll the dice here with a fifty-five thousand training and get a ninety-nine player. I might roll the dice and get a player that's only an eighty. No, so we about to roll the dice right now. Why? We want to get a hundred thousand dollars. Try to do our best to get a hundred thousand dollars on here so we can get that Lucas Van S card. We'll whoop some ass in the game. So about to buy our training pack right now. We're gonna see what the fuck we get from it. Okay. Decent card. It's an 85, but it ain't about the 85. Y'all just see that coin fit that just popped up? That means the normal 85 will not give you this mini coin. This is a limited 85, so it gives us 65,000. Hey man, we need 100K, man. 65 is halfway there, more than halfway there, so we can take that 65. That was a good pull for us. Now we got 234. We need 270 or such to get this Lucas Van S car, so. We'll go back to the notebook. I get a prize or two. No matter what you do in this game, it prizes like doing all kinds of shit. Again, uh, y'all gonna see what going. Y'all gonna see. But uh, we got a little bit closer to our goal, which is what, 270,000. So we we lose one of our guys. Now we're gonna sell him. I don't need a center. I got Corey Lynn in a red tornado from him. Motherfucking Tampa Bay, all right? So, tell this again. Another 57. Now, this is all I have. I don't have any other sellable items in my notebook. Items in my notebook are already started, so I don't want to sell them because I'll be missing the starter. Got these other motherfuckers in the notebook that are not sellable. Some cards are sellable, some are not sellable, some you can only sell, some you can only get for training, some you can do shit with. You guys are gonna learn next year. Oh y'all everything. Uh, let's go on head on, man. We got 234, 234,000, man. Trying to grind up right now to get to this man ass. Buy another variety pack again. Sometimes I'll buy a variety pack and get there. That's a 80 overall. Oh you know? it, it is a crapshoot. Really lucked up with our last one, so have some good wishes. 
and uh, buy this training pack and see what the fuck they get with it. We trying to get Van Ayers right now, y'all. Let's see what we get. Strategy item. This is a high-end strategy item. You guys will learn about strategy items. No. Next man. Madden Ultimate Team for dummies. Talk y'all through everything. But uh, this is something I can work with because these are also worth money. I'm about to show y'all. All right, sorry. Let's see how much these are worth first. 55,000 coins, y'all. So regardless, I am in the motherfucking game. I could cash this bitch out right now. Go get my Lucas Van Ness. Put them in my lineup. Have them terrorizing shit this year. And they're going to give me a version of his card next year. What we going to see is... There's a quick sell item. As you see, I can quick sell this bitch for 55,000 coins. And that'll give me more than enough. Go get that Lucas Van Ness card. But what I'm going to do is... There's all kind of sets you can add this shit to. Oh, I'm going to go to add to set, right? What does add to set do then? Two of these, if they have two of these, say I got one of these before. If I add it to a set, this is what it would do. See? Already had one, right? So if I add this one to the set, that's going to get me legendary strategy item. These are... That's what this shit out. This shit called Epic. Yeah, this is an epic strategy item worth fifty-five thousand. What is a legendary strategy item worth? Fucking a hundred thousand. Being that I already got one, I got fifty-five thousand already. If I add this one to the set, I know it sounds like a different language to y'all, but I'm talking y'all through it. But uh. Now, I'm gonna add this shit to my set. What that mean? Give me a motherfucking hundred k, y'all. See, I just redeemed it right now. After you redeem sets, back out. Just gonna show you the award you're gonna get. Clearly, I already told y'all what I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get a legendary strategy item. It gets no higher than a legendary strategy item. Legendary strategy item not add to a set because it gets no higher. Anything you can do, quick sell it. Or you can auction it. Quick sell, hey, give me 110k in my pocket right now. Auction, I can sell it for 150k. I can sell it for 130k. It depends if a Falcons fan might want it. This is specific to a Falcons team. So I'm not going to waste no time and keep adding this to the market and trying to sell it. The least you can sell an item at an hour. Like, look, I can auction it, right? It showed you the last four auctions that it went for. They gonna give me 110 off the jump if I just cash it out now. Now, if I wanna wait, I can up the price and maybe a sucker will go and pay for it. I ain't got time to wait for them right now, so I'm not gonna try to quick sell this. I'm gonna, I mean, I'm not gonna try to auction it. I'm gonna quick sell it, y'all. So, Give me my motherfucking 110k. Add that to what the fuck I got, y'all. And now we have enough to get this Lucas Van Ness card. We gonna have him for next year. So let's go get our boy. What we gonna do is go to sets. Yeah, I ain't even lay a finger. I ain't even play a game, y'all. Play a game, you know. I just have money in the bank, money in my pocket. So now. This motherfucker hat. Here you go, right here. We already brought one player. Now we just gonna buy one more. Deepest player on the board. It don't really matter. Definitely ain't gonna get Scotty Miller. Fuck Scotty Miller. Uh, get this guy. Buy him. And we're gonna add him to our Lucas Van Ness set. To have our guy, man. To have our guy. How much money I got left over? 69,000, 13,000 trains. The job is done, man. This is the final card that I'm purchasing. And uh, there he is, man. Look at man, that's gold 99 for the rookie, y'all. Got him on the squad now. There it is.
I sleep. They also giving us a rookie token. This is the this is the big daddy right here, man. We gonna put him in the lineup immediately. We love you, Julius Peppers, but we gotta let the young rookie shine. You had a Packers career already, you know, so now we gonna third move. That's it. Our lineup. We already have another Lucas Van Ness, but he's not a goal 99. The 99, but he ain't a goal one. No one makes a difference. Again, for that difference, to even show y'all the difference. Happy we got our guy. About to show y'all something else we can do with this game. Oh, therapy. Right? So. This is in order of the best players in the game. You see, Reggie White is the best player. I agree with that. Now, Jordan Love being the second best player, I totally disagree. Because they have him kind of fucking bullshit. Okay? Oh, you know. Barry's Romeo, third best player in the game. I beg to differ. That motherfucker drops two passes. So, uh, hey, but for Luke to be in the top five, you know, that shows how good of a card he is. That shows he's better than the Julius Peppers right here. And Peppers is really a left end. I just checked, put him at linebacker because he goes. Oh, we're gonna have a young rook hold it down. But he also about to do it. Pair this fan ass to go 99 to the other loop fan ass that we have. Okay. This is the other one we have. You already see the differences. Fan ass I have is a 98. The other one is a 99. You're like, oh, it's only one, one, one great difference. But it makes a difference. Speed, 94 compared to 91. Very important. Acceleration, 97 compared to 94. Very important. Strength, 97 to 99. It's a better car. Now, what we do in this situation cannot start the same player in the lineup. So, what we're going to do is we got this 99 goal, Lucas, already. We're going to get rid of the 98 one. And the 98 one, still, some people will still buy them. He's a good car. So what we're going to do is sell him on the market. If we don't sell him on the market, you know what we're going to do. We're going to quick sell him for some training, some more training to buy a training pack, all right? But we cannot have two of the same player in the lineup. We're going to take this, this out. We got to take him out first before we can insert him into the other This is butt maintenance, y'all. I ain't played a game. I ain't played it now, but I'm getting my team better. That's what butt maintenance is about, bro. You be on here two, three hours just maintenance in your team. You know, not even playing games. You just selling players, buying players, getting training, making players better. Like that's a part of this game. So right now we're gonna insert Lucas Van Ness in our lineup and see what the fuck he can do. I might take y'all my next uh matchup. You no know, online head to head. Guys about. What we gotta do is take him out. We just gonna put anybody in it right now. Put the one on brain it really does. Ray Ninsky now we gonna get the new list that we have. Insert him in the line up. Okay. He's in there, so you can also do is compare him to Julius Peppers. We can do that right now too. To show y'all who's better. James, compare. Got the new Lucas against Julius Peppers. Got. See that the blue is where Lucas has an advantage. They gave that boy a 99 speed. That's that's crazy. They gave this Lucas 99 everything. That's, that's crazy. This car is going crazy. Y'all seen how much better he is. Julius Peppers. And I told y'all Peppers was the top one the top guy. Now he got him by the height, six seven, and that really comes to play with this is playing that linebacker because in interception. This is the better player. Following with Lucas, Julius Peppers will be on the bench. He'll get in, start third down and shit, but uh, we gotta go with the young buck man. Now I'm taking Julius out. Is it? I'm also gonna show you guys right now how training how training uh also helps you out. You don't just buy training packs with training, you also make your players better. So Lucas, 
Go to upgrade. How do we upgrade him? We use training. It costs five training to upgrade him and can unlock all his abilities. We just use five training to unlock his abilities. Now we're going to use this chemistry that they gave us. Comes with it. We'll use this. Add that. It will make the player even more better. So now we can add his ability. This is where training comes into effect. Training can help you get players, help make players better, help you get training variety packs. So right now, look at all these things that we can get, all right? These are certain abilities. Like look, no outsiders. Quicker run sheds against outside zone plays. He's gonna be on the outside. So if they run it on the outside and I have this ability, it's gonna be easier. But I'm a bull rush kind of guy. And you can kind of see which abilities are better by what costs more. Doesn't always correlate, but El Toro is 6,000 training. You gotta think that that's more dominant and better than these other ones. So give him an El Toro for sure. That's basically just a full rush. And that's something that Lucas Van Ness does have at his college fucking film. He has a bull rush, so I'm gonna give him that. That cost six thousand. So uh already got the bull rush. Now I get to pick another one. So I'm gonna go with spectacular. Now I'm gonna go with uh I gotta go with Run Stopper, man. You know, anytime they run, Lucas is gonna be in there. Lucas is gonna, you know, have a chance to stop him. Go go with that and craft that ability. Think training to do this. Okay, so look. Else. Now this is starting to tax us. One AP. See, listen. Yeah, we're going to go over all this shit, but look. These two abilities cost zero AP. Now, AP, you only get six AP per unit. Six APs on offense, six APs on defense. So we got two abilities for no AP. That's a fucking steal. But to add another ability, take us one AP. How many left over? Our other players are using. Nair is using two APs. Grave Digger is using probably two APs. So we only got two more. So we'll just leave Lucas like that. But yeah, man. Mission accomplished, man. Hey, we started off this bitch with $160,000. We, we hustled up another 100K to get this player. We're going to see how the fuck he does. He picked his pepper spot. And, uh, you know, we're going to see if it was worth it. Now we're going to activate the abilities. We got to do that. We just activated those. Uh, Julius Peppers, we're going to activate his too. We took him out the line of us. We got one more AP that we can use. We're going to use it for our super. We could get his acrobat. Well, uh, that's it, man. But maintenance, man. Be on the lookout for that series next year in the new Madden. But maintenance, man, is just getting the team better. We're going to do this shit together. We're going to share ideas. Y'all going to let me know if certain cars is it. Y'all going to let me know if it ain't it. And that's motherfucking it now, y'all. Oh.